Here on a beautiful day in Texas, we're going to go ahead and take the Rambler for a ride. It's first glimpse of sunlight. Yeah. But the throttle, the throttle's almost exactly the same. The only difference is, is you've got some actual good rubber grips here. Your hand doesn't want to slide, it wants to grip it, just like on this side too. Flooring it. It's 350 watts, so I cannot expect a lot. It's very smooth. It's a very quiet, very smooth ride. Decoy family? You need more clones? Clones are like 32% of all sci-fi fights. You don't get to own clones. clones. Decoys. They're exactly like us with a few tweaks and a backdoor shutdown. Shut down. Shut down. Just get Just hard. Get hard. Creating stadium. Actually, oh my gosh. 235 pounds. It's a full charge. This is its uh, first time outside. Full charge. 235 pounds. And it already does not want to leave my community. Brakes, brakes, brakes. Not the best for a guy like me in its current state. Seems like I'm snubbing this thing. I don't wanna, I just paid for it. No discounts, no sponsorship, no nothing. But uh, let's go ahead and focus on the good stuff, shall we? Let's have try to have a good ride. That's me flooring it, it is floored. How do I feel on it? I feel cool. I like the seat. The seat's awesome. It's a really cool seat. I like the tires. The tires are pretty neat. I like the frame. The frame is pretty neat. It's pretty cool. It's real smooth. It's it's intuitive to turning. When you want to turn, it just automatically kind of wants to lean for you, make things easier. Handlebars are tall, so my knees are out of the way. Look at that. I always have a thing with my knees being in the way. And they're not, so I may look to get these for the uh, for the MX bikes. I mean, I bet you these would probably fit pretty nice on an MX650 or an MX500. I like it. I like the seat. I wish there was a way I could slap that on there. We already have a fix for that. Uh, if your butt hurts while you're riding an MX500 or 650, let me know, and um, we can fit you with a tall seat. But I also recommend that we change the body kit too because it's a lot of work to do on a factory body kit. Razor did not make these things easy to modify on purpose. So we have to be crafty. Back to this bike. 350 watts does not say a lot. But this is obviously about style. This definitely has a lot of style. I really like the way it 
swings into place. But I don't like the fact that I only have this one tiny little break. And I really got to squeeze it to make it work. I like it. I need more out of it. Seems like I'm doing 10 to 12 miles an hour. inch wheels man I, I really enjoy it very nice in the dirt definitely like the confidence in spiders when you're in the dirt Not making it up this hill easy. I'm gonna have to change these batteries out, put some life bugs in. back in. I guess we could say hello to the new tiny Super 73. I like it. It just needs some improvements. It, it needs some safety improvements for brakes. And we got to get rid of those lead acids and we can stick anything in there. But for the sake of safety, the most safe battery cell so far is lithium iron phosphate. So we're going to slap a couple of 36 volt, 10 amp hour batteries in her. See how much better she performs. Bird, 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 bird,